What's up guys? Thank you for tuning in to Ice TV. My name is Philip Price, the Gamer Dad, and today we're showing you how to unlock Oolong's Soul Emblem. Now, before we get started, I just wanted to remind everyone to show your support to the channel, like, subscribe, and ring that bell to get the latest tips and tricks as soon as we post them. Oolong's substory is the only one during the intermission between the Frieza Saga and the Android Saga that rewards you with a Soul Emblem. It's pretty simple, and it reveals some pretty interesting insight into why the Saiyans' tails never grew back once they were cut off. If you have any trouble starting the substory, check to make sure that you do not have Vegeta in your party, as this will prevent the start of the side quest. After you talk to Oolong, head to Kami's lookout and, well, talk to Kami. He'll basically tell you he doesn't know jack about Saiyan physiology and that maybe it would be best to ask a Saiyan. Head to the Gizzard... Gizzard... The Gizzard? Geysard? The, the, the Wasteland. Just head to the Wasteland and uh, once you arrive there, you'll talk to Vegeta. You will find him brooding about the worthless Kakarot and he will demand that you fight him. After you deal yet another blow to Vegeta's pride, he will completely avoid Gohan's question about their tails not growing back, leaving Gohan to come up with his own unproven theory. Report back to Oolong with this theory, and they pretty much just run with it. Now, I find this substory pretty interesting because while they explain why Saiyan tails don't grow back, they really don't at the same time. I mean, what do you guys think? Sound off in the comments below what your theories are as to why the Saiyan's tails never grew back. Do you agree with Gohan and Oolong's theory or do you have your own? Again, if you found this video helpful, don't forget to like and subscribe and ring that bell. You can also join me on Twitch where I stream every Friday night. And for all your gaming guide needs, stay tuned to Ice TV.